You're watching BaseNet Internet Television, a BaseNet Intermedia Group company. I'm Julie Mulia about Los Angeles, and I'm here in Thai Town in Hollywood, California, at the 10th annual Thai New Year celebration. At the Soon Kran Festival, traditional dances brought in the New Year as an angel was revealed on Hollywood Boulevard. Religious areas were set up throughout the streets so that different faiths could worship. We usually uh, do the respect to the old people by pouring water over their hand, and then we don't know more. Over here, we like we have Buddha, and we do it. We ask, ask for the witches by pouring the water. And young and old alike, dressed in traditional attire, shared what the Thai New Year meant for them. So in Thailand, we usually um, splash water to each other, but maybe not in here. Maybe it's too cold. The more we do it, the more a lot of Thai peoples and all cultures come to. For the good luck, for the fun, for the... Oh, I can say it. Every year with Thailand, yeah, have a lot of, have a lot of Thai festivals, yeah. There was also a boxing ring set up at the end of the festival where Thai boxers fought and the crowd went crazy. Music, free food, and the opportunity to make their own parasols had people really enjoying themselves. I like food and, you know, chance to meet people because my friends, like, all my friends come here and we meet up and we have fun together. It's pretty, it's okay. It's hot. It's pretty, <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty big. A lot of people here. Though. Yeah, I want to make a traditional Thai umbrella, but it's life's a little fail. As we are nearing the end of the Thai New Year celebration, we are reminded of just how diverse Los Angeles is by the thousands of various people that came out to partake in the festivities. I'm Julie Marie about Los Angeles.